Welcome to the Half Ass Homestead. My name is Angie, and today we're talking about price gouging and how it's working on you. I am going to show you some recent listings from my local Facebook marketplace. I saw a price decrease of 12 cents all the way up to a price increase of $1.25. I encourage everyone to go out and check their local stores to see what the price of canning jars is new. I can go to the local fleet farm and buy a brand new pack of ball jars for $9.99 when they're on sale during canning season. That makes Walmart's price a little steep. So then why would running out and buying a dozen jars for $12 sound like a deal? I went out and I bought these ball canning jars for $13 and 44 cents for a flat. Okay. These jars have never been used. I wanted a legitimate brand new set, all matching. The grand total on this receipt is $14 and 11 cents. You know what we're doing today? taking off all of these lids and rings and we are going to put them back up for sale on Facebook Marketplace for $12 for the dozen of $1 per job. And we're going to see how many people would like to purchase them. Now one twelve dollars per dozen jars of used canning jars is I'd say a very common price and it's on the lower end of what I've seen. I've seen them as much as like a dollar forty five a jar. Which is insane because they're not a dollar forty five new. Okay, so and people buy them. I don't know what the deal is. So I'm going to photograph these. I'm going to put them up on my Facebook marketplace and we're going to see how many bites we get. This is my listing that I posted on Facebook marketplace and the bite count was actually pretty high. I did start leveling with people and telling them exactly what this was and that this was a social experiment where I'm testing out price gouging and how people react to it. Um, I did offer a set of mixed jars for $9 a dozen and some people did take that. Sorry it took so long to get this video put together. Harvest kind of got in the way. Such is life. However, I would like to thank you guys for watching. And I hope you guys are a little bit more aware of some of the crap that's going around. Like happening on Marketplace. And I hope you guys have the ability to make slightly more informed decisions. Um, sometimes buying it new is better. So... I would like to thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.